Knockout City just released a brand new mode, and I'm here to give you tips and tricks on every single superpower to help you win your matches. Okay, so we're going to start it very simple with Super X-Ray Vision, one of the simplest abilities, but it doesn't mean you can't do it well. So obviously, the main idea could be, if you're in a well-organised team, to say, you know, someone's running up on you, someone's here, but, I mean, that's never really going to work as well as you think you do. So the main thing is to make use of that long range that you can lock onto people. I have a video here of me doing it against a friend, and also have this Reddit user. But you see, you want to lock on, and then most commonly you would throw a curve throw to go around the wall. Obviously, you don't have to be at such a distance, you can also do it through walls, and you can also look through fours below you, so you can drop on people. They don't know where you are, you know where they are, this is the best way to use this ability. Okay, so now moving on to Super Ball Form Bounce, one of my favourites, but we have a few basic ground rules. One, do not overdo it. With a lot of these, just don't overdo it, okay? Don't be balling up every single second. Go help your team. Go help them win that fight. And two, is don't do whatever I'm doing in this video, okay? Yes, just don't do this. But we have got some tips. At the start of the game, it might be very helpful to do this ultimate because everyone's condemned together. It's not going to work every time, but on Jukebox Junction, like I did in this clip, they will stand together and I've got a triple KO, and obviously it's a lot more quicker. You could also do this if a teammate has a charge up, he can throw you in sleep. The same concept kind of applies. Okay, so the rest of the tips are what you should do with an ult. Anyway, if you can't reach someone, land behind some sort of wall or something, so they can't hit you during those recovery frames, and if you jump on the bounce pad, you can go back up. All these things you already know, but it's really good at helping you train your ult. Oh, and you can also hit people mid-air like this. Okay, so now we're going to move on to dodge strike, and there's not really much to say about this. Don't overdo it, but there's no real hidden tips and tricks. Just try and tackle as much as you can, when you can, and when you have time. Okay, if you're tackling to another person, it doesn't count if they tackle into you, so maybe back off or jump over them, and tackle behind them. Everything works, just don't overdo it, and don't get fully focused on the tackles. But this leads me on to my next favourite power. Okay, so, super strength. Compared to the dodge strike, it's like a cage ball. Okay, it's pretty much that, but don't overdo it. Okay, it's really overpowered, but you'll find yourself tackling into stuff that you don't need to tackle into, just hit them with the ball. But what you can do is use that stun to your advantage. So first of all, you'll see in this video, I just keep throwing people at the cage ball and the cage ball at the person and so on, so on, so on, so on, so on. And in this video, this redditor, he just threw someone at the ground and then just threw a ball at him. But I found a way to bully people if you check out this video right here. I managed to keep throwing him again and again and again. They are theoretically being able to escape this, but it's really hard to do because when you're spamming A as you're downed, it's not really doing anything. So this guy just kind of gave up and accepted it. So if you want to bully people, try this! <laughs> that poor guy. Okay, so next is Super Charge Up. Really overpowered, especially with the side ball as you see in this clip. Not really much tips, pass and catch. Pretty self explanatory. Okay, so I lost some footage for the last two, which I really do apologise about, but I'll just list them off. Super Double Jump. It's basically a moonball. Try and jump over enemies, hit them from above, and it can help to recover from when you're picked up and thrown off the edge. For healing, just disengage. It's pretty simple. Run away, get your health backs. And you also need to make sure you're countering a lot of these stuff. I, in this clip, pick up someone that's trying to ball form into a bounce pad. I've seen this a few times, it was in a video earlier. But you can also, you know, try and avoid tackles, make them tackle one to you to throw a ball straight at them. Just try and use this superhero mode to your advantage. So, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Comment down below which superpower is your favourite. Now, have I missed any tips and tricks? I'm still new to this mode. It only came out yesterday and I'm not a pro by any means. So, comment down below and I really want to know your thoughts on this video. Did you enjoy it? Was the text too quick? Was I too quick? Am I speaking too fast? Oh my god, I'm messing myself up. But, I hope to see you another time. Check out some other videos here and 